What's up everybody, Jordan here, back with another video, another season of farm videos. First piece of business today is kind of how I'm structuring the farm videos. Um, I'm gonna kind of roll with a seasons approach, like your favorite Netflix series. Stoltz Farm will be coming out with videos in seasons based on the crop year, uh, essentially. So, you know, as crop farmers in a state that has winters uh, there's not a whole lot that we do in the winter that's not just fixing and maintaining things in the shop which i don't really enjoy filming so to maximize my enjoyment and adherence in making content i'm going to structure the videos in seasons which will run april to about november so if you enjoy the farm videos tractors field work all the shenanigans that take place subscribe to the channel so you don't miss anything uh, we're gonna get started with another one today the first one of the 2024 season which i think might be season like four maybe three of the farm videos kind of chilly today but it's been beautiful you can see the geese coming overhead they're coming into our state here and um it's been beautiful we had a really nice spring a really low precipitation winter i'll talk about that more in a second So yeah, we had a really low precipitation winter after last winter where we just kept getting blizzard after blizzard. This year we barely got any snowfall, um, which was, you know, overall pretty nice actually uh, to have kind of a milder winter. We got a little bit of snow at the end of March after not getting anything since Christmas. That's gone now. It's been 55, 60 degrees every single day. And um, today's a little bit colder though. We're kind of hanging out in the high 30s today with some rain. So it's a little bit colder outside. I don't know how much we're actually gonna get done outside today, but we are going to do a few farm related things and I wanted to stick with my start date of April 1st, essentially today's April 7. And we're going to get started with today's video, doing some farm work with a beautiful spring. We actually should be in the field fairly soon, maybe in a week or so, at least with rock picking and maybe a little bit of disking and things like that. I'm coming in about 8, 815 today, and you can see one of the tractors already out. This is the 8770. Here with one of the cultivators. Kind of the first spring project we're gonna do, and I don't know if we're gonna do it with the weather a little bit chillier, if we're kind of wimping out, is change cultivator shovels, air cedar discs. We're gonna try to bring the cedar into the yard unless this rain kind of makes it too wet out in the field. We're not gonna rush it, there'll be drier days, but if it is ready, we're gonna come bring some stuff into the yard and start working on some prep for planting and field work starting in 2024. So enough talking, sit back, enjoy the video. Let's get started with the intro, new season of farm videos. Let's roll. So this little cultivator and then one of our other chisel plows in this row of equipment here that's parked is uh, kind of has a little bit of hydraulic issues that we're working through. This one was just a little bit unlevel and the wings are getting let down kind of weird. And then the other one just had a hose that was constantly breaking. So we kind of need to secure those hoses again after we fix them already. This is the one we're bringing in the yard right now. The rain's coming down pretty good. So I think this will be the last thing we bring in the yard. The air cedar is already at least out of the dirt and is just sitting in the grass over by our sheds. That's ready to go too. We have to change some discs on that. And this one, we just got to figure out the hydraulic stuff today. So here's the air cedar up ahead of me also out of the field and hooked up. This one, we need to change some of the discs in the back that, you know, essentially make the groove for the seeds to go into. Uh, some of those are just 
needed to be replaced. That'll be a project for a nicer day, I believe. Not ideal weather today for kind of the start of this new season of videos, but we are gonna work all day and I thought it would be good to start here in April because this is kind of what spring work is like as you kind of prep for getting stuff into the fields and picking rocks, disking, whatever it's gonna be. A lot of times you gotta deal with the weather of the spring, which can sometimes be a lot of wind, a lot of rain. Cold weather, warm weather, it changes every five minutes it seems. And today's kind of prep day. Uh, we're gonna be getting some stuff ready, at least some stuff in the yard to see tractors moving around. Kind of makes it seem like it's spring work, even if it uh, isn't gonna be in the field today. So we're gonna move this stuff in and probably tinker around with a little bit of it as much as we want to be outside and then work in the shop a little bit today as well. Um, other stuff to do, I think there's like a leak on the backhoe we're going to fix. There's a couple little things, little random things we're going to be working on. I'll keep you guys updated as we go. Stay tuned. off the 7510 which makes it just feel more official that it's springtime and no longer winter here in North Dakota. I am still wearing the big coat but it's a little bit warmer today. This is now Monday. Uh, we kind of did some shop related things for the remainder of Sunday. Got a good amount of precipitation. Uh, the things are drying out now just a bit sloppy in the yard. Coming back from the big city uh, with uh, this little Ford truck that we had repaired in town. Just coming back now with this thing. It was finished, we have uh, room in the yard for it and it's kind of something good to get out of the way while the weather's still a little bit sloppy. We're gonna be working on some of the air seeder discs here in the coming days. For now, we're gonna do a couple more things around the yard, call it quits for today and for this video. Stay tuned, more good stuff to come. All right, we're gonna go ahead and end the video here. Kind of dabbled a little bit more in the shop here today. Um, kind of here sitting inside at the end of the day. Lots more to do here in the spring, getting ready for getting into the field. I think we might be in the field at the end of the week. We got some days in the 60s and even 70s we're gonna touch here in the following week. Back with another season of farm videos. Again, we're gonna kind of structure this in seasons. So this would be season four, I guess, of Stoltz Farm Incorporated channel. And um, thank you for joining along the way. Be sure to subscribe to the channel, like this video, even hit the notification bell so you don't miss a farm video. This one might be on the short side, but I'm going to pick up the camera again tomorrow and film more great stuff. We're gonna work on the air seeder a little bit tomorrow, get things prepped and ready for planting season and um, kind of keep you guys updated when we get out in the field. It's April 8 today and spring's work is right around the corner. Things are about to get busy on the farm. Thank you for joining me for another video. Talk to you later.